Beginning with the 2006 model year, a new turbine input shaft speed sensor has been added to the 4L60, 65, 70 E series transmissions in some limited model S and T series trucks. Use of the ISS was further expanded to many additional platforms for the 2007 model year. Refer to the chart shown in figure one for a list of transmission models and vehicle platforms known to be affected at this time. The ISS signal is an input to the control module that will be used to better monitor and control line pressure, shift patterns, torque converter clutch slip speed, and gear ratios. This component will allow the transmission to enable use of computer instructions related to shift energy and abuse torque management and will provide much improved diagnostic capabilities. The new input shaft speed sensor was gradually phased into production and certain design level criteria had to be followed. Preparations actually began early in 2005. A general outline of these production changes and the reasons for the changes are covered in more detail in your printed handout material. The ISS assembly, as shown in figure two, is a three-wire Hall effect sensor and is internal to the transmission. ISS operation should be thoroughly evaluated with a scan tool prior to transmission removal for internal repairs. Due to the ISS circuitry design with its internal integrated circuit chip, it is not beneficial to measure internal resistance and therefore no resistance values have been made available. Externally, the ISS signal may only be checked with a scope or waveform viewer capable of testing the voltage and frequency of the signal simultaneously. The steel locating brackets are necessary to keep the ISS wiring from coming into contact with the rotating reverse input clutch housing. These brackets push fit onto aluminum bosses that are cast into the oil pump cover. Be careful not to forget the O-ring or improper converter clutch operation or drain back concerns may be caused. The input shaft, as seen in figure three, now has 15 rotor teeth added to trigger the ISS and the seal ring grooves have been relocated inboard towards the rear of the unit approximately 190 thousandths of an inch when compared to the previous design. Some pre-ISS model input shafts may have the rotor teeth machined in place and some may not. This was a manufacturing option. For this reason, great care must be taken when replacing the input clutch housing and turbine shaft assembly. A measurement must be taken from the frontmost oil seal ring groove to the base of the input shaft where it is pressed into the clutch housing and then compared to the replacement component to ensure compatibility. There is a new internal wiring harness to go along with the new input speed sensor and it is shown in figure four. This harness can be easily identified by the black pass-through connector. The ISS circuit shares pin position E which is spliced internally to supply key on feed voltage to the sensor. The additional pin terminals are K for the sensor signal and V for the low reference. The previous design internal harness still used in non-ISS units can be identified by a gray connector.